When David Brinkman bought this lot along the Broad River, he did not know what was sitting on his property. It was an accident. We had no idea when we bought it. He hired landscapers to clean up the area. When they got down to the river, they found boulders. One of them ran up and said, you know, it looks like we've got something that's like man-made. I started doing a little bit of researching on it at that point to try and figure out. And that's when I suspected it may be a bridge remains and it could be you know, the Confederate bridge. The Broad River Bridge ran across here in 1865. Union General William Sherman was crossing that bridge when Confederate soldiers burnt it to keep him from taking over Columbia. This rock was part of the support of that bridge. Historians thought bridge remains oh, may not exist bridge, because the bridge may have been made out of wood. Brinkman found good evidence that the rocks yeah, were part of the original kind of Broad River Bridge. Time, Searching for maps and more evidence uh, has become a hobby for him. He even has a website about his findings. I knew we had something. But Brinkman does not think his land will become a public history site. We want to preserve it. I'd like to keep it as much like this as I can. But, he plans yeah, to stay question, here and keep his home as it is. 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 Autumn Dudley, Carolina News. So the wood structure would have started. Get down to the beach.